Hey guys, welcome to Six Sister Stuff and today I'm going to show you products that you need in your kitchen. I'm Kendra and I'm Kristen and today we're showing you our favorite products mm -hmm. and not only are they our favorite but they're also really inexpensive so yes. they are perfect Christmas gifts or just gifts or just Things you you actually just do treat yourself want. to these. Yes, these you want them in your kitchen. Time savers <laughs> is what I'm taught. Time savers, space savers, they are life savers. I love it. I love it. So if you are new to our channel, go ahead and subscribe so you won't miss any of our fun videos and all of our delicious recipes that we share with you. So we're first going to start with the pot strainer. Now you yes. might have seen this like Facebook ads and stuff. Mm -hmm. So we decided to try it out and see how we liked it. And we love it. We love it. <laughs> I'm always the person that's like trying to hold the pot and the spatula that's like keeping the noodles in. I think we learned that from mom though, right? <laughs> yeah. I mean, it works, but it's not. But you lose some meat, you lose some noodles. You lose a lot. So this is super easy. It just clips right onto your pot. Nice. And it just strains it all for you. No, you have, you can use both hands nice. to dump it. Yeah, and I love that it, okay, so it's like right up against the pot. Yes. So you can use it on bigger pots. Mm -hmm. It even fits on like the small the pots. You want to show them? Yeah. Oh, so clip so one side, clip the other, and it's literally just right up tight against it. So it's perfect for for all kinds for of all sizes: rice, noodles, meat. So we got this for like thirteen dollars on Amazon. Now we'll yes. put a link in the description for you there. Product number two. So I have a hard time pulling apart all of my meat. And it's if it's too hot, it's gonna burn your hands, but these bear claws are the most handy. Wait, wait, wait. You Sorry. don't like using forks to do it? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, forks are okay, but uh, there's the prongs are so small. But look at these beasts. I know. These are bear paws, and they can just shred your meat so easy. Pulled pork, chicken. I literally did a rotisserie chicken with it today, and yeah, it was yeah. quick, seconds. I love doing, like, making a like roast beef and just the yeah. meat just shreds mm -hmm. so easy when you use those things. Yeah. So, huge fan of that. Okay, so we got these bear claws for like $10 on Amazon. So still of a deal and super helpful. And <gasps> totally worth every penny. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Item number three. We are gonna talk about the mini spatula. Now, I didn't really no, I did not believe in this thing until about five years ago <laughs> when my sister let me borrow it and oh my gosh. It's not, it's a game usually changer. you have huge spatulas and mm -hmm. so you're trying to like lift up brownies and yeah. you get three brownies yep. instead of your one. So how much is this one on Amazon? So this one is $8, but I have seen them at the dollar store before. Okay. I don't know how good they are, but, but for $8. me, $8, it's worth, it. it's worth it. Okay, product number four are these magnetic teaspoons. And I don't know about you, but I always keep mine in my drawer and every time I open and close it, they're flying all over the place. Exactly. So I love these magnetic measuring spoons because you won't lose them. They all stick they together. They all stick together. And I hate the ones that have a ring on them because I'm always too lazy to take them off the ring. So then I just wash them off. <laughs> you wash all of them. And, and then, they, so then they lose what yes, they say on I them. Know. <laughs> So, magnetic teaspoons, and these are about $13 on Amazon. Totally worth it, you'll never lose them again. And perfect size to fit into a stocking. Yes, mm -hmm. for sure. Okay, product number five is this little chopper, and it's amazing because it will just chop everything for you. I am a total onion cutter, and I cry every time. I've tried the hacks, I've tried the goggles, the bread in my mouth, I've tried it all. <laughs> And nothing works, but this will chop potatoes and make french fries, it will chop tomatoes. Carrots, what won't it like, chop? Literally, it will chop all the vegetables and yes. it's super, super sharp. So, so just be careful. Okay. There you go. The one, two, three, pat. There you go. All right, should we see? Yes, look at all those. Look it. So let's look at them all trapped up. <gasps> look at those. Oh, nice. Now, uh, Perfect for cooking and baking. Yes, yes. I would probably take those and like put some olive oil, yes. garlic salt, and then just roast them up in my oven. Yeah. Yeah. Um, Delish. Huge fan. Huge fan of this chopper. <laughs> <laughs> so you can find this on Amazon for about $20, but worth every penny because it's a total time saver. Okay. And a finger saver. Knives are hard with potatoes. <laughs> they are. And they take a really long time. I know, they do. <laughs> Is our pineapple chopper. Mm -hmm. Now, if you've never seen this before, you you need one. I'm telling you, if you eat pineapple and if you love pineapple, I'm going to show you just how easy it is. So, I'm actually just going to cut off the top of the pineapple 
Ooh. Not a professional <laughs> here. Not a professional. Here we go. There we go. Oh, sorry. And then we're going to cut off the bottom too, just to make it easier for ourselves. Take that too. Thank mm -hmm. you. Okay. So now in the middle of your pineapple, you can see the circle, right? Yes. Okay, so that's where you're going to put this little guy. Oh, gotcha. So you're going to just put it, try and put it as much in the center as possible, and then you're going to push down. So all you got to do is you're just going to hold it here and then hold your pineapple. And then twist. Whoa! I know. So the only trick is you have to try and just stay center in the pineapple the whole time. Okay. Oh, that smells so good. I know. Taking to smell Hawaii. It? And I'll show you my favorite part of it. Okay, once we get to the end, can you see it coming through? Oh, ooh, I did not do a good job staying in the middle. <laughs> Still like I was. Okay, we're gonna go all the way through, and we're just gonna pull it up. What? Okay, so you can throw that in the garbage. Okay, I love that for like Thank grilling you. though. That's right? like I know. hamburger So size. it actually is all together. Okay, so then you're just gonna take your knife and just slowly just cut around of however big chunks you want. So I just like, wow. you can do it in salads. Um, yeah, Keep literally. it as rings for Yeah, hamburgers. you can keep it however you want. Oop, we're flying, we're flying. But anyways, you get the gist of it. Okay, super, super easy and simple. And way more fresh than canned pineapple. Yes, mm. oh, and maybe you'll have a little more control than me. <laughs> I'm wild, I'm wild with this. <sighs> So this one goes for about $12 on Amazon. Again, we'll put a link in the description for you. Are these collapsible measuring cups. So if you don't have a lot of room in your kitchen cupboards or your drawers, this is a great way to save space because they just fold right up. Nice. And they stack right on top of each other. Look at how much space you're saving. I love it. Those so are like, so awesome. They come in groups of four usually. Uh -huh. And so you can fit all four in literally it's like this tall, in like that much space. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And I also love these for when I'm like doing peanut butter cookies or like have honey ah. because I can help like push, push the peanut butter out. out. So on Amazon, these are about $10 for a pack of five. And again, we'll put a link below yes. just for you. <laughs> Is a cookie dough scoop. These now, are my favorite. <laughs> I didn't have this till about two years ago, and my sister uses it all the time, and I'm like, man, mm -hmm. I just roll mine, I it's know. fine. No. But her cookies are so uniform. Yes, they look perfect. Even like the cookie dough that's like a little softer, like a pumpkin cookie dough, this so is easy. Yeah, because you can't roll that. No, you can't roll <laughs> it. And it just goes by, like I did no bake cookies with this, mm. and it just, you just go so fast, yes. and you're not covered in Cookie dough, dough. Exactly. which isn't a bad thing. <laughs> so those are our kitchen inexpensive must-haves, perfect for Christmas or just to, you know, to pamper yourself yeah. with. <laughs> All right, you guys. Now we're curious of what your favorite kitchen item is. What do you use in your kitchen? And what do we need in ours? Because... <laughs> yeah, we would love to hear. Yeah. <laughs> what are we missing from our nine? <laughs> Well, thanks for watching, guys, and don't forget to come back next week, and don't forget to subscribe. Bye!